Okay, here we are on the uh, shoulder joint, the ball and socket portion of the shoulder joint, and the socket is on the left, the ball's up to the right, and I have my shaver in coming in from the front, and I'm taking out the uh, some of the labrum, the cartilage that goes around the periphery of the socket. I'm taking out all the non-repairable tissue, but you can see how it's loose and detached from the front uh, edge of the socket. Now I've got my shaver in the interval between the socket, the glenoid we call it, and that labrum, and we're going to bring that labrum back down to the edge. The first step is to put a stitch through it, and I'm reaching through and grabbing the stitch that I've passed. Um, this is actually a shuttle stitch. This is a black stitch. It's sort of a lasso, and I'm going to pull that lasso out of the shoulder joint through that cannula, that plastic straw, and now I've got a hold of it with my stitch. This is a drill guide. It has a window so that I can see the drill bit coming down. We're now going to drill into the bone. There is a depth stop on the drill bit, so I'm drilling the appropriate depth in the bone. Then I'm going to take that out, and I'm going to pass an anchor. This is a plastic anchor that will dissolve over several months, as will the stitch. Here's the anchor. We're tamping that down with a little mallet uh, and a pusher down into the bone. You can see the uh, laser mark on the tamp so that we... Uh, tamp it down to the appropriate depth, and then I'm coming in with a pair of scissors and I'm cutting the stitch, and now we'll, I'll come in with a probe next and just test it and make sure that we've appropriately snugged that labrum, that cartilage, and repaired it back to that front edge, and that's a very nice repair.